welcome back to Oppenheimer's Allies. Well, I'm going like to teach you something today because, you know, not everybody out there has the same devices. And not everybody out there uses apps on your phone. This is right. Not every one of us uses an app for selective social media on our phone. This is correct. Let's take, for instance, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, or our Gmail. We may not use those on our phone. I know I don't. I don't know about you. You might, but I do not. I prefer this. Uh, there's reasons why I prefer this. I've had cyber issues, and I prefer not to have that on my mobile device. So to show you something, and I'm going to say this, Instagram. Sorry, but there's more than one way to crop a picture for Instagram, and you definitely don't need an iPhone. You just need the camera that's on your device, and that's it. You just need the camera that's on the device and center yourself. That's all you need. Center yourself. Make sure you're sitting lower than the actual camera. That's all you need. That's what I did here before. Putting it where? on my Instagram. Wow. Doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure out. That you don't need an iPhone to center yourself. Know why I'm squared in these? Because that's how this device is set. That's exactly why. Until I figure out how to widen the view. In fact, I would prefer to have a wide screen on this for video. I prefer it for something in my eyebrow. This is how my eyebrows look in the light. Anyway, um, I prefer to have a wide screen for my videos, but for that, are you kidding me? You must not know how to pose yourself. I used to be a model. There is no way that you are not going to know to to make sure you are in the middle of the picture you took. Yeah, I make sure that you are in the middle of the picture you took. That's 
that's right. <sighs> it's so sad that a lot of people think that you can't just center yourself in the middle of the picture. Do you see that? That's actually the wide picture, the full picture. But when I went on Instagram and posted that, now you see there's a huge, huge difference between this picture and the picture that I just posted on Instagram. Big difference. Don't let anybody tell you that you have to use an iPhone. That's crap. That's crap and you know it. You have to use an iPhone. Let me tell you something. No, you do not have to use an iPhone to be the center of a picture. That is crap to the whole of Centered myself with the middle of my phone. Do I have an iPhone? No. Can I crop? You hit edit. You simply hit edit. You hit the little spot right here. Then you bring it down. Bring it over. Bring it over. Oh, look! Copy. You hit done. You hit save copy. And guess what? You hit share. Guess what that does? That gives you what? Choices! But guess what I don't do? I don't save or send that to apps. I don't. And you know why? Because I choose not to. I choose not to have my location on the whole entire world to know where I'm located. You know why? It's none of their business where I'm located. It's none of their business. Last year, an old man tried to kidnap me at a farmer's market. It's nobody's business where I am. You do not need an iPhone to crap a picture. That's the end of that crap. Right now, that is the end of that crap. That is crap Ola. There are plenty of pictures on my Instagram of me in the middle of the picture. In the middle of the picture, yes, that's me and my regalia. But guess what? cropped picture. And guess what? I'm not using an iPhone. In a square. Get the picture yet? I don't want to hear any more of this crap about needing to use an iPhone. And only an iPhone. That's crap, and you know it. Stop telling everybody that they need an iPhone. That's a lie. 
flip my drawing of the Angel of Grace. Guess what? Cropped a square in the middle. That's a piece of my artwork. Yes, I drew that. cropped in the middle, right there. I have plenty of my pieces of work. Plenty of photos of me, pieces of my artwork. Silly things that I did just for fun. photos of food just because just because the picture of me last year again no iPhone Stop it. Do you understand how conceited that makes you look? When I have people come to me and say you need an iPhone for that. You know, I'm, I'm going to roll my eyes about it. I just proved you wrong. You do not need an iPhone. Stop with the stuff on stupid. You do not need an iPhone for that. That makes you look very stuck on stupid. And you need to stop it. does not make you look very smart. And I know I'm going to get some backlash for this, but I'm going to tell you what. I didn't have the other books. I, look, I had high school and college books in grade school. And I didn't pass aerospace engineering for nothing. Now, I'm not calling you like the dumb of dumb, but learn some tech. You do not have to singularly have a device to go on Instagram. I just showed you that. I don't use a phone to be on Instagram. I don't have to use a phone to be on Instagram. In fact, you don't even have to use a phone to be on Snapchat. Hello? These are social medias that you need to learn about. Learn your social media. And learn that you can use it on a laptop or a tablet. You need to learn these things. Don't just blurt it out and say, oh, it's for a phone only. And by the way, the iPhone, you can only use iApps. Only from the Apple Store. Can't just use it from any other store or apps for smartphones. You can't. It's not allowed. Google does not allow it. Google does not allow that. Anyway, so I hope that I taught you some good tech today and that you do not have to have 
an iPhone. You take a picture and crop it. For Instagram. Or even Snapchat for all that goes. In fact, you can use Snapchat and crop a picture. You can use Snapchat and crop a picture and then transfer it to Instagram. That's another way to do that. There, I just gave you just, there you go. That's another way to crop your picture. Use Snapchat to crop your picture if you want. That works. There are so many other ways to crop your picture if you really wanted to. You can figure it out. Like I said, it does not take a rocket scientist. Now, I'm not going around watching that other person's channel. I just have people coming at me saying some stuff. Guess what? I delete those comments. I don't care for it. So you know what? That's why I just did this. Leave it alone now. Just leave it alone. I just showed you something. Okay? Leave it alone. Let it go away. Let it go away. Just let it go away better things to do. I have a coat to finish for myself and I already finished my shawl and I think maybe that's why people said oh she's uh guess what I don't care I don't care I do not care because that person's fake I don't care let the fake fade away. I don't need fake in my life. What I need is for people to stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed. Because there's no room for fake. 